I guess na naman ang tanan. Excuse me. So, uh, let's uh, mag-prayer sa ta. Sa Dio. Ano lang sa Muslim. Ay, Muslim. Uh, Christian. Sorry. And then sa Muslim is ako na lang. Tunggu nanti ko. Yes sir. So, yes sir. Let's see. Right. Uh, yeah. Ayo, uh, in the name of Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, Amen. Lord, we offer to your request today. We pray that through your divine guidance, we would learn how to listen attentively to the inputs of our teacher. May we, may we appreciate our teacher's effort in imparting their knowledge to us. Amen. Okay. Uh, for the Muslim prayer, ako. Oh, Billahi min ash-shaytani rajim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Maliki yawmiddin. Iyyaka na'budu wa iyyaka nasta'in. Dina shiratal mustaqim. Shiratal ladzina an'amta 'alaihim. Ghairal maghdubi 'alaihim waladdallin. Amin. So, good afternoon class. Good afternoon, good afternoon sir. Good afternoon sir. Good afternoon sir. Good afternoon. So, gapon, di ba, is uh, Mother's Day, nag-greet na mo sa inyo mga inahan? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Very good. Dapat dili lang sa Mother's Day, ha? Dapat term yung everyday, na, everyday Mother's Day. Dapat magbinutan. Okay? So, last meeting is kanang nag-talk about ta sa dessert, di ba? So, kung sa gali ang four types sa dessert, Hello, ini volunteer lang. Pas? One second. Tropical, coastal, cold winter, sir, o guan, sir, polar, sir. Okay, very good. Um, wait lang. Okay, very good. So, tenang. Kita ni yang nak slide. Tak pasal. Tak sir. Kaitan na, class? Hello. Yes, sir. Bro, it's good na makita na, sir. Okay. Di ba last meeting is katong, we talk about those uh, types of mga desserts. So, we have this itong ingon ni Aliana na anang Yeah, uh, tropical, cold winter, and cold winter, tapos na coastal desert, and we have the uh, port, uh, po polar desert. So, so kanang nakabalutan na sa mga lay-laying desert, dili lang day ang desert is in it. So, karon is akane. Ang sayo niyong na-observe sa... Ang sayo niyong movie day ay... Kabalo mo, Ani? Ice Age, sir. Okay, Ice Age. So, sayang surrounding is... Ang sayo niyong na-observe, Ani? Hello? Ah... 
us. Sir? Ay, inyong na-observe ay uh, sayang surrounding. Sinihi. Ay, sir. Ay, So, mga... Dere. Karon is gikan sa pagkainit or karon is then hito sa pagka-cold. So, karon is we'll talk about this uh, blazers. So, but if mandunggan yung kanyang blazer, yung tayo yung naunaunahan ane. Yung tayo yung first na word na yung naunaunahan uh, then he. Ice, sir. Ice good. <laughs> I just miss ya. <clears throat> what are glaciers? So can ni? A glacier comes from the French word called glacier. So meaning ani is ice. So you know you do ice ni siya. Glaciers are often called the river of ice. And <clears throat> glaciers are a large uh, Perennial accumulation of the crystal, ice, uh, snow, rock, sediment, and often liquid water that originally on the land and move down the slope under the influence of its weight and gravity. <coughs> Sorry about that. So, massive ice sheet cover much of the North America and Europe during the running uh, Palestine, uh, Palestine scene time period. This was the large last uh, glacial period also known the Ice Age. So when in Ice Age, in a, Ice Age is na itabon ni siya sa toang uh, uh, kalibutan. In the ice sheet reaching the greater uh, greatest size about uh, 1800 years ago as a ancient glacier spread they curved and changed the land surface creating many of the landscape that exist today during the penis uh Scene ice age nearly one third of earth land was covered by by the glaciers so Katong na time daw, uh, katong ice age na time is that ang, ang, ang earth is kanang one third of the earth lands ang nag-cover sa, uh, ang nag-cover sa glaciers. So, karon about one tenth of the lands, uh, earth lands, land is covered by the glacier. Ay, so lahi kayo sa karon So, karon is parang, parang niinit na ang, um, Ang init na ang kalibutan, yung ano, motong ang uban, a glacier is not milk. And we have this type of these glaciers. So we have the alpine, uh, alpine or the mountain glaciers and the continental uh, glaciers. So first, uh, sa kanisa mountain glacier, we have this uh, <coughs> shrink uh, glaciers. Uh, Valley's Glacier, uh, Pure Glacier, and we have this uh, Edmund uh, Glacier and the Ice Cup. So, Continental Glacier, we have this Ice uh, Shield. And, kani iyang naong sa katong uh, uh, katong Alp, Alpen, yeah, Alpen Glaciers and the Continental Ice Sheet. So as you can see in that picture is the ana uh, ang mountain is mura gitapakan tat gitapak tapakan sa mga uh, glaciers so kana siya and compared to the other one the content which is the content, uh, continental glaciers that uh, kanang a group of a large large uh, ning a group of a large glacier or uh, ice kana ang uh, yang gitabunan ng atong large area o ana yang oh and we have this alpine glaciers this glacier in the mountain that flow down the valley is called the alpine glaciers so to those glaciers that we can see in that mountain ways are called alpine glaciers there are different ways how alpine glaciers are formed 
So, kanis, yeah. Uh, as you can see in the picture is, uh, na mga, uh, mga ice ay sam uh, bundok bundok dara yun ha. So, kanis, yeah, is uh, ma, na yung mga different ways na para nabuo hindi sila. So, <clears throat> Sorry, class, kayo buo lang ko talo. So, we will move on this uh, sharing blazers. The uh, smallest type of blazer that are for um, confined in the valley, valley for in the street, uh, uh, street. Uh, semicircular, uh, in, uh, at the head of the valley formed by the lock of the of bedrock by a glacier moving down the hill so you can see in that picture is kanang uh kanang na gitap hi parang dithana buo ang katong glacier sa katong nag marag ang empty space sa katong uh, mountain is dato na buo ang glacier Yes, kita 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 wag na to old shirt blazers. So kana siya. Hmm. And we have this valley blazers. Ang valley blazer I contain to a valley usually of a stream. If the ani ani yung example sa uh, magita ni dire sa picture. Murag kani ang diplo wan sa una o Uh, water and then nahi mo siya glaciers and if uh, if this uh, valley glacier extend to the down to the sea level it will be curve an arrow valley into the coast, uh, coastline a narrow valley they curve and little become uh, little become filled with the sea water after the ice uh, has milk uh, Pure, so kanis ang pure uh, glaciers. So katong ginong na ako ganina is katong abali glacier is pag muabot na siya, mag explain na siya sa sea level o si, uh, si water is kanang lahi na yan name. So uh, pure ang uh, uh, name na niya karon. So as you can observe, as you can observe that uh, picture is katang likod niya is that what called the uh, valley or uh, valley glaciers. So kana sila. And ang atong uh, glacier is para na extend siya to the sea level is nalay na yung kwan uh, alan which is third na siya. <coughs> <coughs> so karon is nanata sa pinman glaciers so, if the uh, <coughs> two glacier meet and uh, merge at the base of the mountain so as you can observe in that uh, picture is ana ang mga naong sa kaning uh, uh, kaning uh, uh, pitman uh, glaciers or if they have extended the sea level and those valley keep on moving at the uh, and they meet the ridge at the base of the mountain we can call it this one Kani. <clears throat> and we have this uh, tidewater glaciers so If a uh, pin mud, uh, pin mud uh, glacier flow at the sea, it will uh, it will be called a tide water glacier. So, ani katong uh, di show na ganina na pin mud is if kato siya, if ma flow siya into the uh, sea is ma uh, mawala siya sa pagkapin mud. So, may mo na siyang tide water. 
blazers. So kani ay yung uh, naong naong sa tayo blazers. And we have this uh, ice cup. Ice cup. So kani ice cup for example is that atong if an ako na koy cup anti cup is uh, akong gikalo so gikalo na ako akong ulo is nasurang sa katong cup and kanipod siya so imagine katong uh, cup is a uh, katong cup is a uh, ice is katang gikover uh, gi niya ang uh, large area sa katong uh, sa katong uh, area if all of the valleys in mountain ridge become filled with the glacier and this glacier cover the entire mountain ridge so as you can see in that uh, a picture so ang tawag they say lie is the ice cap this ice cap are in a ice mass that cover less than uh 50 kilometers squared so about is uh katosia so the Konga area yang na consume pod. Pero, pero unlike sa kanin na continental glaciers. So, sa kanin na continental glaciers, a large type of glacier on earth, they cover the large area of a land surface, including the mountain area. It's only, uh, it's found only in the Greenland and Antarctica. So, Ikan ni yang mga example. Ganina isa na sila ay ice cap. Pero katong nga ice cap isa dili, uh, dili katong nga whole area yang uh, gitabunan. In sa continental uh, glaciers, ang whole area jud na nang murag ang isa ka uh, continent ang yan yang uh, kwan, yang recover. So, recover sa glaciers. So, kan ni ang yang picture above kato ka si Greenland at saka si Antarctica. So, uh, large air, uh, ang isa good ka continent ang ilang isa veran. Unlike sa, sa ganina na katong si Ice Ice Cup is uh, gamay lang na area yang isa veran. So, this uh, ice, uh, ice shield are sheet of ice. Uh, a sheet of ice floating on the water attached to the land. They usually occupy the coastal embankments. Uh, may extend a hundred of kilometer from land reach to the thickness of all uh, one thousand uh, meter. So kani. So kani siya is the uh, cover the the covering ng land and na extend niya sa water. Tapos, pag na sa water, is nag-float lang siya. So, kani ang uh, uh, continental uh, continental uh, glacier or ice too. And we have this uh, uh, tem temperated and polar glacier. So, ang kaning temperated gla uh, temperated glacier are are also called uh, isothermal glaciers, but they ex uh, exist at the pressure melting point, the melting temperature of ice, at a given pressure through their masses. A mass, sorry. The ice in a, in a polar or cold glacier in the construct is below the pressure, uh, pressure melting point. So, Kani iyang mga uh, example or iyang mga naong. So, kani this one. And we have this one. Kani iyang mga example of the, this uh, so-called temperate, <coughs> temperate uh, and polar uh, glaciers. So, kani iyang example. And another one example. So, karon is uh, na talk ta about sa mga types of glaciers. So, 
Maglitter ang Mayama Formation, Mayama Nganaong. Karon is, wala mo nag-wonder kung as uh, unsaon pag-form pag forma sa kaning glycer class so so <coughs> hello <coughs> yes sir uh, wala mo na wala mo na wonder na unsa yung pag forma sa kaning glycer Wala, sir. So, ito. So, karon is uh, kanang uh, matunata sa glass, uh, glacial formation. So, kani Ang pag-formation. So, glacier begin, begin forming in the place where more snow fills up ev each every day. Uh, each year than milk so kanisya is that <coughs> kanang basta na mo abot na snow and then uh, pagka sunod na po this katong snow is wala na milk na na po mo na snow and soon after the falling the snow begins to compress so pag nga to ang naitabo is pag pag repeat repeat na katong nga process is that Pag malubong na katong <coughs> katong uh, first snow na niyabot is makompress and became denser and tightly compact. It's uh, slowly changed pa, from light a fluffy crystal to the hard brown ice uh, fields. And the new crystal fall and buried this regular slow. So, uh, <coughs> auto siya. Kaning a process uh, is cannot uh, uh, kaninga process is cannot make a overnight lang. Kung, kung example ka na natulog ka pag aguma is anay uh, kaning uh, uh, glazers to delay. So, kani yes, siya na process it's take a uh, thousand a like, thousand to million of years to form uh, to form but on the other uh, but on our climate right now it will only take a short amount of time to milk. So, kanin siya na process is mura, as kayo na time ang yan kailangan, mura po din sa soil katong nagtokta of soil last meeting. Pero, kanin siya pag mag-change ang uh, climate or mag-change ang temperature sa gatong uh, area is pwede ni siya mawala sa uh, uh, isang overnight lang. So, kato ang pag-formation sa kato nga uh, glacier formation. So, so kana ang, uh, you can see in that uh, picture, but para mas makuha na to. And then we have uh, this uh, 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 change in the glacier size. Uh, ag the uh, glacier can change its size by accumulation, which occur by addition of snowfall, uh, compaction, and recrystallization. And we have this ablation. The loss of mass resulting from melting usually at the low uh, altitude where temperature may rise above the freezing point in summer. So, what lang din he is that uh, accumulation is kanang snow ni siya, either or dagang snow ang muabot or gamay. Ang ablation is that kani is about heat mani siya. Kung uh, and <coughs> kani the net uh, <coughs> we have there two, zo uh, two zone of the glacier anatomy. The, uh, in the Accumulation zone is the region where the snow pack or supreme post in the ice accumulation uh, <coughs> persists. In the ikaduang zone is the ablation, is the region where the all the snow has melted away and burned the glacier ice is exposed. So, kanisya, kaninga first zone is that kaniang 
uh, accumulation zone. So, dira ang snow. And, uh, and this, the second was pag mabot na siya sa Aduanga zone, which is the net melting, which is the ablation, is magmelt. Ito nga, ito nga mga glaciers. Until sa may mo silang water, di kaya this uh, melt, or uh, di kaya kaming melting and ice, um, ice birds bagging. So, kana yang uh, oh, kanang paglalagyan kung mamilk ka ito nga uh, glaciers. Na glacier daw is ha, uh, kanang na siya dua ka ay kaning uh, sa glacial moving have uh, two movement kani. We have this uh, this uh, glacial advance and the glacial retreat. Let us know how the accumulation and ablation affect the movement of this uh, glaciers. As you can see in the picture is, at, uh, so first picture is um, ang, uh, accumul uh, accumulation is more snow ang nasaya. Ang yang equilibrium is uh, lower ang yang equilibrium line. And less ang ablation or, or di kaya less ang yang uh, melting. So, may tabo din ni is mag uh, <coughs> mag advance ni siya. So, dili siya dali rama uh, mamelt. Unlike sa katong uh, glacial uh, retreat. So, less ang uh, less ang cumulation na, less ang less ang yang uh, snow. Tapos, ang uh, ang yang equilibrium is high. Sana begin to in that picture. So, more ang, more ang yang ablation or ang reaching point. Ang melting point day. Until na dalira ni siya ma himong uh, water or ma milk. Kaninga uh, um, kaninga um, uh, uh, blazers. And we have this uh, kaning uh, picture. So, ang first uh, picture is uh, is then uh, he ang one ang uh, mountain uh, mountain glaciers or uh, up alpine uh, alpine uh, uh, glaciers. So, ang ikadua is Kani yang, uh, this uh, ang nindot na example din is the continental glaciers. So, ang yang movement is a uh, straight uh, forward lang. And ang kadua is, ang yang movement is pas per dot. Lahe-lahe yang mga movement. Like the, uh, like the slow, the slow form of the mass wasting, we normally cannot view the uh, Glacier movement directly. So, pare po ni sa mass wasting. Kanang, dili kayo ni mamakita na nag-move ka to nga uh, glaciers. Pero, sa, sa mga panang na mobot is gamay-gamay man sila nag-move. Uh, nevertheless, blowing the ice has a tremendous geometric impact on the landscape. Uh, scape. Most glacier moves uh, through a combination of the process, uh, processes, but internal internal plastic deformation is the dominant uh, process. Virtually, all movement uh, gla <coughs> uh, glacier experience this type of flow. Glacier move to the lower elevation under the force of gravity by uh, by two different uh, process. So, kani ang first which uh, we have here internal flow, internal flow or di kaya deformation. So resulting for deformation of the ice, ice crystal structure, the the crystal slide over each other, like a deck of uh, cards. So kani, for example, ani is if na may card, imong is slide ka tong card is marag uh, ka nang na mga na uh, nag point sa ubos. Uh, ubos. 
this uh this is how glitch removed by this uh, internal flow this type of movement is only the type of core in the polar uh, glazers but it's also so core in the temperate glazers the upper portion of a glazer are little when the lower portion be formed by internal flow the upper portion may fraction to the uh, to uh, form the large crab called crevasses so kana siya kana yang movement and we have here the basal sliding so <coughs> Sorry. Mm. Basal sliding is the melting water at the base of glaciers. Reduce the friction by uh, vacating the surface and allowing the glacier to slide across its bed. So, uh, cunning uh, basal sliding is glacier can slide because of, because it's melt under the uh, pressure, salting the of water at the ice bed interface. This can facilitate the complaint and, oh, and enhance the fast ice flow. If the glacier bed is uh, with the many uh, bumps and obstacles, this increase the melting and uh, ice flow. This, prop, this, uh, this prop is, prop process is known as regulation. So, kaning nga process is bitawag daw na regulation. Hmm. And kaning iyang mga actual picture sa uh, basal sliding. And we have this equilibrium and pleasure budget. So, first is the uh, between the two zones in the line of equilibrium which is the point of uh, which is the point at the which output and output are balanced. So, kanisya is ang output, ang input daw niya and output is balanced ang niya. Ha? So, if ablation output accumulation mass uh, balance is negative and glacier shrink. If the two process, if the two processes the result into no gain, uh, no gain or no loss of snow and ice. The mass balance is zero and the glacier is in equilibrium, a balanced state with no gain or loss. So, the gimin lang, lang din he is that kaning uh, equilibrium is balanced ang yang uh, uh, input and output. So, wala sila yung magin and wala sila yung loss na snow or ang um, ice. So, din na put sa glacier budget refers to the balance between the amount of output versus the uh, between the amount of input versus the output affecting the, affecting the glacier stem. So, this, uh, this glacier budget is totally amount of accumulation and ablation. So, for a uh, glacier if ablation exceed accumulation the accumulation then the glacier will meet so if ang ablation ang katonga melting is nag exceed ang um, may tabuan ni is that ang glacier will melt so malana ito siya if the accumulation uh, accumulation exceed ablish, uh, ablation uh, glacier will extend. So if uh, kato na po si accumulation na po ang nag uh, exceed is that less ang yang ma mil uh, milk. So ang may tabo din he is mag extend ang katong uh, katong glaciers. Uh, <coughs> the glacial budget describe how accumulation and milk milks on the glacier will ultimately determine whether whether a glacier advance or retreat. 
sa tong we explain na to ganina na advance or retreat na glaciers. This uh, glacier behavior depends on the balance between the accumulation and the melting. melting. And we have this glaciation. So uh, this uh, process of glaciation, eh, this process of uh, uh, glaciers growth and establishment is this called uh, glaciation. Uh, kanang nakita ninyo din ha, sa picture. Uh, glacier shape the land through the process of the erosion, uh, kanyang uh, uh, weathering, transportation, and the deposition, creating the mystic land form. And we have this uh, glacial erosion. So, an glacial uh, straight long long uh, long uh, parallel scratch and groove that are produced uh, produced at the bottom of temperate temperate glaciers by a rock embedded in the ice creeping um, against the rock under underlying the glaciers this um linear scratch grooves and uh, go juice. So, kaninga glacier region are uh, scratches of a go uh, go juice uh, can uh, cut into the bedrock by glacial abrasion. This uh, scratch uh, were first recognized as the result of moving the glacier in the late uh, in the late. Uh, 18th century. So, moto siya. Uh, kaninga mga mga uh, mga results sa nag-move na mga glaciers. And we have this uh, kanin, the glacial polish <clears throat> rock that has a smooth surface produced uh, as a result of fine grade material embedded in the glacier acting like sun paper on the underlying surface that as you can see in the picture is patong amurag na gray gray din ha is anangitagat gita gita wag na glacier polish so kana siya and we'll move to uh, this one uh, like the rock a glacier can create different types of land form when uh, when Kanisha is not road. La land form produced by the mountain glaciers. We have this shirt, a glacier valley, Aritis, and we have this horn, these hanging valleys, uh, fjord, and Aritis mountain mist. Mountain, mountain mist. <coughs> And ani sila ang ang katunga mga mga uh, kan, mga mga uh, okay. mga land na form by the by the aning glaciers. <laughs> So, first one is the uh, the blow shape depression that occur at the head of the mountain glaciers that resulting from combination of uh, frost raging, glacial blanking, uh, and the abrasion. Sometimes small a small lake called plants occur in the bottom of the of this uh, uh, <coughs> Uh, and we have this glacial palace um, palace that once uh, con uh, contain uh, contain this uh, uh, glacial ice become eroded into the u-shape 
in the cross uh, in the cross section so kani ang uh, glacial uh, valley the stream erosion on erosion on the other hand produced a big a valley that are v shaped in uh, in the cross uh, section and we have this or this uh, if the two adjacent uh, valleys are filled with uh, glacial ice that rests between the valleys can be curved into a shape uh, sh um, into a sharp uh, knife edges in the uh, are called uh, so as you can say kani ang kanang uh, murag uh, uh, kanang murag uh, sharp na pandin na is ana ang ginatawag na uh, and we have this so called this part where a three or more than a uh, yeah, where three or more uh, shrink I curve out of the mountain, we can produce a sharp uh, peak called, called a, a horn. So, kana ang ginatawag na horn. At ang uh, sayang taas. So, we have this hanging valleys. So, hang, hanging valleys is when a glacier accompany uh, a small uh, tributary valleys meet the larger valleys that uh, tributary glacier usually does not have the ability to ability to erode it's uh, based on the floor of the floor of main valley and is called the hanging valley waterfall general generally occur when the hanging valley meets the main valley so Ana siya ang ang nasaubo sa horn is that's what we call the hangi valley. And we have this uh, 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 fjord. So so kani ang uh, example ka. Uh, Iyang naong are narrow and let's along the sea uh, coast that were once occupied by the valley glaciers called uh, pure glacier so ani is uh, gikan is sa valley is katong uh, valley glaciers and then pag na meet na niya ang kaning sea level is mahi mo na siyang pure glaciers and we have this uh, one this uh, uh, rocks uh, mountains uh, as Asymmetric bedrock hills or curves that are smoothly rounded on the up side, uh, up ice side by erosion, with the blocking evidence on the uh, the root down side, uh, down ice side. So, kani ang nang niya ang yung And we have here the land form produced by the ice caps and the uh, ice uh, sheet. We have this uh, abrasion features. The, <clears throat> the same small scale abrasion features such as uh, stration uh, and glacier polish can occur beneath in the cup and the sheet, particularly in that uh, in uh, temperature environment. So we have this streamlined form. The line surface beneath a movement continental ice sheet can be uh, molded into a smooth long uh, form called this drum lens. <clears throat> so we Karon is a uh, kaning nanata sa glacier transportation. So, uh, glacier move very slowly as they move. They transported the, the material from uh, from one place to another as a freezing the weathering occur, occurs along the edge of the glacier peak of rock, which break the 
break of the uh, large rock fall into a glacier and and are transported so uh, connect connect uh, language yeah and we have this uh, this uh, glacial dep deposit so kanisha is dilina ko dilina na ko kwan ka na dilina ko siya i-discuss further because of kung discuss pa na ko nisha is ma kanang ma uh, mahorot pa tong horas and I can see is the ice lane deposit till erectus moraines uh, and we have this uh, ground moraines the end moraines and terminal moraines the lateral moraines medial the gradual um, marine drift and we have this uh, drum blinks we have this uh, stratified drift the outwash plane the outwash uh, terraces we have this uh, cable uh, lakes and we have this camis and comma terraces and this uh, is curves and kani ang ilang mga uh, kumbaga ilang mga location since the glacier are so late they can transport the transport all the size of sediments from hog uh, um, so the, the co how size the boundaries to the fine grade clay size minerals the glacier can carry this mineral material on the surface or embedded within it this sediment transported a uh, transportation is a glacier it's very much different uh, than that in the swims uh, that's a uh, sediment deposit directly from melting of a glacier can waste very poorly short to better uh, shorted depending on how much water transport like uh, take place after the ice melt or sediment deposit as a result of glacier erosion and this is a uh, called glacier drift so kanang nagita niyo sa picture is kana ilang mga question and we have this uh, this one pod and kana ang mga tawag sa ila ha and kani pod ani ang mga features of uh, deposition niya and we have this moraines kani niya ang mga location and we have this uh, glacial age a long uh, long term uh, variation is a climate a 10 of million of years on the single continent are likely caused by a drifting continent if a continent drift toward the equator the climate will be warmer if the continent drift toward the poles a glaciation can occur on the continent so meaning lang din here is that if katonga area is mag drift or mag move into in, in the equator, is kabalo mantas equator is uh, in it in it or warm. So, kung may tabo dito is mamil, katong mga, uh, katonga mga abrasures. If ang continent is mag drift into the poles, is that uh, ang glaciation will occur. So, nai may tabo dito na uh, katonga uh, formation of the Glaciers. So, uh, you can see in that picture is uh, uh, is that kanang ang white din ha is the is ang uh, glaciers. So in uh, 18 years before present is kana kadag kadag ko ang mga glaciers. Ito nga sa kanang area and sa karong modern day is that mas really mas ni gamay jud ang atong uh, continental ice so because tungod tungod siguro ni sa mga uh, sa climate na nag change and then 
uh, cause of a gradual uh, gradual age. The first one is the astronomical factors. Uh, uh, a century ago, Serbian scientists really uh, Milutin Milalkovic uh, hypothesis that long the long term collective effects of the of change in the in Earth's position relating to the sun are strong derived of the Earth's long ter term climate and and uh, and our responsibility for triggering the beginning and end of glaciation period which is the ice age and we have this as atmospheric factor so ang atmos ang nadire sa atmospheric factor is that heating up in gases sometimes called this greenhouse gases or anong greenhouse gases is uh, sikat ni siya so ini katong naitabunan ni siya they are cause the most of the climate war uh, climate warming and the glacier which it in the past uh, 50 years so we have this uh, uh change in the organic uh sir <coughs> circulation okay. oceanic circulation sorry a small change in the ocean circulation can amplify the small change in the temperature a variation produced by a atmospheric atmos, uh, atmospheric so astronomical factor we have this the cause of uh, glacial age ang, ang mga other factor niya we have this the uh, 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 the energy output from the sun by flat rate. <coughs> <coughs> the large, uh, we have this uh, large uh, explosive volcanic eruption can add the significant quantities of the dust to the atmosphere, reflecting the solar radiation and result in the uh, in the global global cooling oh did you notice is mas ni init na karon compare sa una pero uh din he put sa kanang na observe uh, na ko din sa Marawi is that uh sa una is always nagpag pag din he and then karon is uh, mas ni init na ni na siya it's not ni init so we have this the uh, how the glacier affect the life on earth we have this glacier melting water provide many region with fresh uh, drinking water they can home the homes and habit habitats for many uh, organism in our animal kingdom uh, melting water aka run down of glacier water provide energy resources uh, to the certain country uh, they provide water to the search region they are also natural resources <clears throat> and people all over the world use this melting water glacier to do so people living in the arid climate the near mountain of them relaying on the glacier melting of their water for part of this uh, year and we have the farmer also originated the crops for hundreds of years by channeling the melting water from the glacier to their uh, fields. And ane ang nya mga effects of uh, matima glaciers. So the part kani so mato siya. Uh, dapat kaning mga kwan is sa pangalagaan para din hini maurot so any question about uh, regarding to the topic so uh, so 
Hi, question. Regarding to the topic, or wala na. <coughs> Hello? Wala na, sir. So, kung... Uh, kung wala na is... Uh, thank you for... Uh, attending our class and then thank you for your time. So, Mauro to. Uh, goodbye class. Goodbye, goodbye sir. sir. Goodbye, sir. Goodbye, sir. Goodbye, sir. Goodbye, sir.